Hi everyone, this is Renee from Tippy.com and this is a Tippy How To. We are going to look at a couple typing tricks on the iPad because we've gotten some questions and we've seen some internet chatter about um, some things people wish would be easier on the iPad keyboard and it turns out some of them in fact are. So we're just going to jump into notes to try this out. Um, bring up the keyboard. So one of the first things is, for example, and this is true on the iPhone as well. If you want an alternate version of a character, for example, I can type an E, but if I want an alternate version of the E, I can just hold it down and it pops up with all the accented forms. The overline, the cedilla, the accent aigu, the accent grave, circonflex, everything, um, every kind of accent you could hope for. And the same is true of other characters that offer those options. So these are different versions of the character C. You can do that for pretty much anything. If you want to quickly type a capital letter, you don't have to press shift and then press the letter. You can just touch shift and slide to the letter. It does the same thing. Likewise, if you want to hit exclamation mark or question mark, you don't have to go shift, exclamation mark, shift, question mark. You don't have to press number key, question mark, exclamation mark. Um, you can do the same basic thing. So uh, from the letter keyboard, I can just touch and slide to question mark, touch and slide to the exclamation mark. Another one that might be familiar to iPhone owners is instead of hitting a uh, number to type a number and then coming back for uh, to type another letter, um, there, there's a shortcut for this too. Now keep in mind that if you want to type a bunch of numbers, you're better off hitting number and then going back. But if you're typing some text, uh, and you just want to type in a quick number, it's, it's a hassle to hit here, hit here, come back. So instead of that, you're typing your letters, you touch the key, you slide, you hit the number you want, then you keep on typing your letters. And um, you can do that pretty much as much as you want. Bum, bum, bum. Here. It just works. The last one we'll show you is one that um, is especially annoying on the iPhone keyboard because there's no um, apostrophe, there's no um, single quote. So you have the comma, you can press it to your heart's content. Apple mysteriously hid the pop-up here. So you just hold that down, you get the, the uh, single quote. But you don't even have to hold that down, you just press the button swipe up and you get it. So you can be typing a line of text like don't hold it down, swipe and then you have it. Don't hold it down! Exclamation mark. Thanks everybody. This is Renee from Tippy.